Go. Your saliva is made up of tiny DNA of yourself. But what if someone spit and uh, their DNA was like tiny paper cut, uh, tiny paper figure, like origami figures of, well, I guess now they're making tiny little animals. They could be llamas, they could be pigeons. Oh, I forgot my mask. So these tiny paper figures, I, I, uh, swans are popular. People make these swans. And what if someone spat a configuration of that not the DNA, but the full embodiment of these paper figures. That would be that their spit evolved from the DNA to an actual figurine. The easier way to perceive what is the difference between the mitochondria evolving. Look at all of I've never seen so many cigarettes hidden. What establishment do you think these cigarettes are hidden? In a bar. <laughs> I, can, I can taste them in my mouth. So is that an evolved, an evolved way? Was I just tasting? When you throw out a used cigarette, you're throwing out part of your saliva as well. So when I was just tasting all those cigarettes together, was I tasting the DNA genetics of people who was spitting that at? If I was more accumulated, I could see pictures in my brain as I'm tasting their spit from the cigarettes that were discarded of everyone who was in that pile. This is what snakes do when they flip out their tongue. They're tasting the air to read information. Wow, that was pretty cool, but, but now I'm gonna have to strap my sweater on my face and use my zipper and I'll be considered a zipper head. If this is in the future, you'd probably think, why? Why does this guy always have a sweater on his face or a, a, a large? I'm here to tell you that this is the day and age where this is the, the best we've got. You know, if you forget an N95 that collects uh, bacteria when you breathe into it, that you circulate within your, kind of like a water cycle or uh, a, a land mass. A la land masses recycle uh, in more time, but they, they, they do. Interesting. I thought it was a DNA. I had to look closer. I'm like, no, that's not DNA. Candy uh, before it's been touched, but maybe it was inside someone's mouth and they wrapped it up and then um set it down there excuse me then it would be a dna it would uh not on its face but on prime fascia it would be a dna within the uh construct of its uh wrapper but back to me the reason that the the sweaters on it's not put on the the body correctly is because uh, i forgot my mask <clears throat> and it was uh, a great day today because the, the newspaper said individuals no longer need masks unless they choose them. The businesses uh, can follow suit as well. Unfortunately, businesses have been more scared than the people to uh, not wear the mask because there's no assurance of wearing an invisible giant may punch you if you don't wear a mask. Just out of respect, the whole idea of that, me getting a refill without a mask on, I almost feel guilty. If I was the person who made someone feel like they were sick, that's where it comes down to. We're, we're all getting the same, we're drinking from the same water hole. And the person going to the water hole without a mask on. But now I'm looking like a a-hole. I choose the uh, clown. Uh, identity over the a-hole. So. And what's tyrannical? You might notice that like there's differences between a de-evolving where like you can de-evolve different if you're wow the sound picks up a lot different when I'm in herd. What we're chasing is a herd immunity in order to um not wear masks. And one way that you can do this is not by de-evolving or evolving. The science isn't out yet, is if you're putting in uh, stuff into your body, if it will evolve or de-evolve. I to mention a procedure uh, it, that people might get offended by. A radical transformation, to say the least. But in any case, um, wow, what a great place where I just found. This is actually where I, I voted 
or I tried to vote. This was in the wrong position and I had to go to a church. First time I've ever voted in a church. That's why I say that the United States is founded on God and the reasons being voting in a church is a thing. Did I agree with it? No, but was that what I was told to do? Yeah. So in changing your body is something where you can like try and figure out is eating food changing my body? Yes and no, there's good and bad and everything. So is injecting um, a concentrates into your body good or bad? And how much different is that than food? Uh, so anyways, you might notice that my uh, blanket or my uh, scarf is gone or my sweater is gone over my face. Now I've got something a little bit different, but what if these weaves of the, well, this is elastic. This is like a netting for different than my sweater, but the same as I could snap my finger, make it change into this. Would I choose that option? Yeah, I would. But is that be evolving or evolving? I think that's the um, stanza that you need to take in order to understand the notion of what is actually occurring when you're fighting an invisible giant who has a swamp manifesting that's also invisible. You can't hear the bell anymore, but wow. Do you see how I just jumped out of that area? That's kind of like what spiders do when they jump out of their hole and then attack. But that was just different because we're speaking on the sound escape from that region of what I just did in jumping out of the hole because it would be orchestrated in a better uh, fashion that is and so I'd feel less guilty doing what I just did if it was acting for the common good in everyone. Thanks for watching.